Our days on Earth are numbered, according to Professor Stephen Hawking. The world-famous physicist has previously issued warnings to the world that robots could wipe out humanity and that leaving Earth is our only hope. Now, in a new book, How to Make a Spaceship, the physicist has warned our planet is becoming a dangerous place because of the threat of war or disease. The book, written by journalist Julian Guthrie, contains an afterword by the physicist. In an extract published in The Garden, Professor Hawking describes his views on the future of space travel. I believe that life on Earth is at an ever-increasing risk of being wiped out by a disaster such as a sudden nuclear war, a genetically engineered virus, or other dangers, he said. I think the human race has no future if it doesn't go to space. Professor Hawking made similar comments earlier this year while recording the BBC's annual Wraith Lectures on January 7. The lecture explored research into black holes and his warning was made during questions field by audience members. When asked how the world will end, Hawking said that increasingly, most of the threats humanity faces come from progress in technology. The scientist, who turned 74 this year, said the threats include nuclear war, catastrophic global warming and genetically engineered viruses. We are not going to stop making progress or reverse it, so we must recognize the dangers and control them, he said. Speaking to Radio Times ahead of the lecture, to get away from these threats, humankind will have to colonize other planets, which Hawking believes will take more than a century. We will not establish self-sustaining colonies in space for at least the next hundred years, so we have to be very careful in this period, Hawking said. Research regarding sending humans into space remains strong. This week the U.S. Senate introduced a bipartisan bill that authorizes a new $19.5 billion budget for NASA to send a crew to the Red Planet, but mandated it must happen within the next 25 years. Professor Hawking has also previously singled out the risk of artificial intelligence becoming powerful enough to cause the downfall of humanity. In July, Professor Hawking and Tesla founder Elon Musk led 1,000 robotics experts in an open letter warning that autonomous weapons will become the Kalashnikovs of tomorrow. The probable lifespan of human civilization is much greater if we're a multi-planet species as opposed to a single planet species. Elon Musk said last year, if we're a single planet planet species, then eventually there will be some extinction event, Mr. Musk said. His company SpaceX is working to send humans to space. Last week the firm test fired one of its new Raptor interplanetary transport engines which the company will use to carry astronauts to Mars. The rocket engine is three times more powerful than the one on the Falcon 9 rockets. It will ultimately be used to launch SpaceX's manned spacecraft off our planet, Mr. Musk, chief executive of SpaceX said the rocket will be ultimately capable of producing thrust of 690,000 pounds over 382 seconds. The engine is powered using liquid methane and liquid oxygen rather than the kerosene used in the Merlin engines of its Falcon 9 rockets.